after my fight. Welcome back to the Spin and Backfist MMA show. We are now joined by the Bellator champ, Chris Cyborg. Mm. The boxing fight, thank you guys for having me here. And it's gonna be one week ago, it's a very exciting fight. Yeah. And great to see the girls too, you know, last weekend too, very nice. Yes. This is the deal. I sparring a lot of girls from boxing and that's fascinating. Yes. You would think at some point in your career you would have one, but that makes sense that you would want to do it because of that. Yeah, as you know, the beginning of my career, I started training boxing. Yeah. And I told my coach, so I would like to do a box fight, so I'll see how it works. Say, Chris, I'm going to bring you on place, because then can find the opportunity for you. So then I start training in shooter box. Shooter box with this Muay Thai MMA, a big name, a lot of people from there, and some Silva, when they Silva. So, and then I started doing MMA. But, and when you yes. talk about that legacy, like you have done so much in MMA, do you feel like you like have anything to prove at this point? Nah, like uh, now I, I don't think I have to prove anything, but I like to improve. I like to fight better, you know, better, better, getting biggest fights for my fans. And yeah, so, yeah I enjoy the moment, enjoy the time, you know, I think it's, it's, it's good. You know, I go to Brazil, it's a work. Brazil, the, the passion for everything from soccer to like yes. even random music stars like yes. the, the passion oh God, of yeah. brazilians are like it's very inspiring and just awesome to see so it's and obviously it translates to Hey guys, I just left the bars to sports and now here I'm in New York and I'm now be waiting for the interview with Fidel. I'm very excited. First time in person. Be cool. I'm gonna take, you have a belt here, huh? Yes. I'm gonna take my belt out. This is my uh, broadcast right. belt. No, no, right. but nice. your belt is way cooler than mine. And uh, who's that, Ray over there? Uh, Ray's in the house, but man, thank yeah, you so much for coming in. Yeah, that's great. I think a towel for you too. You brought a towel for you? came yes. bearing gifts, Chris. Yes. Wow, your stuff, by the way. Uh, it, Ray hooked me up with the shirt from the last yes, day. Yes, Very yes. good quality stuff. I really appreciate it. Please, have a seat. And then my first day, so okay, okay. my first time in person. I oh, one, I love it. Sticker. I love it. Look at this. <laughs> wow, this is great. I got the towel right here. Yes. The, I mean, you do very well with the merch. Oh, so thank, thank you so much, Chris. Yeah. Welcome. Uh, you were at the fight on Saturday. We have a lot to talk about, yes. but we just had Eddie Hearn in, so I wanted to ask you about the experience. What did you think of the night, the event, Madison Square Garden, all that stuff. So when you're watching that on Saturday, when you're seeing how great of a scene it is and the fight, what is going through your mind? I can do that thing. I, mean, I want to do it. I want to do it. You yes. want to do it. You want to yes. be in there. Yes. Why, why, why do you care? You're one of the greatest MMA fighters of all time, regardless of gender. Why does this mean so much to you? You know, it's a challenge. You know, and in the beginning of my career, before I did MMA, I was doing boxing. Mm. So, and then I, doing, I, I did MMA. 
So I and I always did I, I did a wrestling, computer wrestling, my Thai, Jit, but I never had the pre box opportunity. Mm -hmm. And before I finished my career for sure, this is one of my dream. And I like strike. All, all my fights finished by KO, you know, I like to strike. So it's gonna be good. What's up? Oh that sounds great. This is fun. Who else is coming by? Sixteen years fighting. This year gonna be seventeen. I'm not the biggest fan of noodles, okay? I don't eat usually, so but I love pho. So I say let's try, it's number one in Japan, so we came to try. It's a big line all day here, like huge line, three hours waiting in line. We get in the end, like almost be close. The girl say, I'm not sure you're gonna get in, but we shoot that in the line and you make it. So we put two person, we pay $75. So I never no pay no tip, no new tip. So I never pay so much expensive than one noodle. So, but was good, was good. <laughs> Yeah, oh my gosh, it is so close to God. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. It's an honor. It's, a, it's an honor. Guys. Yeah, everything. Yeah, everything. Let's try the Sydney one. Have the best pizza. Thank you. Let's try. Thank you. <laughs> what is that? Cheese pie. Cheese pie. Cheese pie. Cheese pie. Cheese pie. How come you're carrying your shoe in your hand? My feet, no, no fit the shoes anymore. <laughs> I'm gonna do princess. Oh, Cinderella.